their best. I agree. It allows them to set up those very... Uh, uh, blew the chance early on. Peke in trouble here. He's got Flash available, but he's got three members on towards him. There's the Zenith. He's going to completely lock up. That's first blood. Here goes the Yankos. He's done a pretty good job of this one. Look for the Zenith Blade or the Sonic Wave. That's going to start it. Oh, they're going to go towards Soaz. They don't realize that Cyanide is there as well. It doesn't matter because Soaz just gets dropped. No problem there. Salivar gets the kill. And positions to the mid to late game because he's about to find two members of Fnatic. And uh, warding out on getting knocked back here. Peke going aggressive. Cyanide comes around the side. They pull the ward down. Turns it back around. Zen the blade goes in. Vanda has yet to get his ball up. And Yellow Star catches the Aqua Prism beautifully. Yeah. He's going to make his move in towards the mid lane instead because that bottom lane has been held by Salovey. He's been keeping it there, which is why he's going looking for overpower. Does not land on towards him. Is it going to quite be enough? He's going to tower dive. And Reckless has got the power to take down overpower. And he grabs himself. The Reckless a little out of position. He's going to get caught with the Zenith Blade. Quickly gets locked in towards there. He's going to go down. Overpower gets the revenge. And that's Rocket. have got the second lowest number of dragons in the league. That is a very AP Lulu when he's feeling under pressure. And there's a double gank. Overpower in mid as well as the top. Beggar Inferno Bomb does not really find his target. Overpower nevertheless is in trouble. Cyanide's going to pick up that kill. A double combo. And that Flybush. Actually continuing to go aggressive on this one. Does he think Reckless is on his own? He's going for it. Doesn't realize they're both there. Destiny comes out. Yellowstar gets focused. He goes down. And now Reckless is in trouble. He's going to run headlong in towards Salava. They just gun him, gun him down where he stands. And that was a simple double kill for Rocket. Been used overpower. Looking. That's Ooh, Ghost. not the card you're looking for. Ghost used. He goes for the red card. Dodges out of towards the Mega Inferno Bomb. Vanda comes in. Flashes. Gets on towards him. But on the backside, we see Cyanide come through. Peke's in trouble though. He's going to get locked down. And now Cyanide needs to run. Have they got the stun to catch on towards him? Sonic Wave gets in there. Yankos can't get either side of him. Has to safeguard away. Teleport comes in. Soaz joins the party. He's going to be very, very low. Aqua Prison catches on towards Vanda. They're going to dive this one. The tower's going to go down. Vanda's got nowhere to run. Has he's going to escape? Fnatic back away because the teleport comes in from Zazas. He chases on towards Yellow Star. Deeper, but at different times and on different pages. They cannot do that against Fnatic who have got such strong pick champions. And they're oh, gonna get oh caught. that's going to be overpower. He's caught out. He's going down. Reckless gets himself a revenge revenge. <laughs> This is going to be a tower trade. One for one, but Fnatic come out ahead because they picked up a Mega Bomb stops any push in its tracks. It really does. And unfortunately for Selfie, I think his Mega Inferno Bombs are a little basic. Oh, They're not oh, reckless. Oh. Reckless caught out again. Overpower is this time not. Yes, he does. Gets it yep. with a no wild card. Back and forth. They've killed each other. And thanks to the rest of his team having damage, he doesn't need anything more. And they've caught Yankos. They're going to try and go in for this one. Destiny is ava not available. Sorry, Sullivan's going to try and catch out. Zazas went way too deep on that one. They're going to continue chasing for now. Can they turn this one around? Zazas is trying to escape. Cyanide's going to lock him down. The bouncing bomb comes rattling in there, and Cyanide locks up the kill. Rock out with just a amount of time to get some auto attacks on this turret. They managed to dodge the bubble. Solar Flare locks on towards Peke. Zenith Blade follows it through, but he's clean to get away from this one. It's going to be Reckless they focus on with the gold card, but he gets away. Zazas pounces in there, but doesn't get close enough. And Fnatic have escaped this one clearly. Destiny being used. So as it's separated, Overpower comes in, but eats an Aqua Prison straight away. Now they're locked up. This is a messy, messy fight, but it's Fnatic that are turning it back around once again. Yellow Star, Mega Inferno Bomb lands on Overpower. It's not quite enough. Cyanide's going to keep on chasing. He gets the speed boost from Soaz, but it's not enough to lock on towards him. And they will escape for now. A one for On Fnatic's side. There was no hourglass for overpower either. And then here the turrets. They've got no objectives to hold on to on their side of the map. And Reckless, he's looking for Vanda. Reckless is going in. He's found him. Mega Inferno Bomb's in there. Reckless gets the kill on Vanda. And that's the item threshold. Blue Club stat. It was unaffected. The rest uh -oh. of Fnatic, they want Zazas. Zazas caught out, standing on a ward. They're going to go for overpower instead. That's going to be the the uh, wild growth knocking him in the air. Zazas now locked up. The wave comes through, not quite catching on, but the Aqua Prison down well does. And Zazas goes down to Soas. Yeah. Out, but it will be the inhibitor that will fall to Fnatic. Yeah, this, this, it, it's risky. There's two seconds left on Overpower. He's respawned, but he does go in. Gods. Solar Flare goes down, locks onto Reckless, but there's zero follow up there. And that's an easy kill again for Reckless. This time around, they're going to keep on chasing. Yankos man lands the. Because Yankos, even though they didn't kill him, they forced him away. That is a complete dance, will it be? Maybe a waltz, I don't know. I'm not too sure. Salva's going to go in there, trying to get a bit of poke down on towards him. Cyanide's going to be the focus target, but the wave comes back on through. Doesn't really catch in. There.
Teleport comes in, not too sure that's where Zazas wants to be, but it will be where he ends up. Cyanide is the focus, taken pretty low from this one. Not a bad fight by Rock Fender. They took that one down earlier on. So this time around, look at that. The wild card's coming around the side. So as might get picked off at the side here, the rest of Fnatic have to try and move into position. Overpower flashes in, catches on towards Cyanide. They lock him up with the Zenith by Wild Growth being used to save his life. Fnatic backing away from this one. Rocket all fully healed on this one. A lot of damage going on towards Zazas once again, but they hold on to the inhibitor. Salava out of position, could land a good cooling. Yeah, they need to be careful. If Salava does get caught by any crowd control, he will go down. Inhibitor's down to 20 percent of its HP and Overpower no longer has that Ghost or Flash to engage or look for a fight. Celebar's made it back into the base, but look at the respective HP bars. Rocket are lower than Fnatic. It's not over. They oh, Aqua them. Prison on towards Overpower. That's the Mega Inferno bomb following through. Cyanide gets the kill down towards him. Vander in trouble. The shield's not going to be enough. Solar Flare lands down, but he goes down to Peke. There's the inhibitor going down. They could 30% the health down towards it, completely gone now. They're gonna push on through, the tower down. Yellow Star catches it, Aqua Prism on towards Salivar. Do not follow through this time around. They're a little bit more cautious. They don't have the damage. Jankos goes in, great kick, followed by a Dragon's Descent, but quickly, Destiny comes out. Where's he gonna go? Comes out off the side there. Wildcard can catch all four members. It does, it wilds on through. Rocket got so much damage going down here. You can see Yellow Star in all sorts of trouble. Vanda's gonna get the Zenith Blade back up in just a few moments. Salivar, he can dash once again. The other side's going to be the sacrificial lamb, but it's not quite enough. Beke caught out. Yankos goes down. The ace could come through. Baron's available after this, and Rocket are running for it. They have to go for Baron now, with a very big death time in the fight. Baron's secured. They're going to defend the Nexus turrets, and Zazus is going to get himself... Oh, this is risky. Oh, I didn't see the respawn. So Zazus gets a lot of damage, whatever play you want to make. You want to make a play around blue, red, dragon, Baron. You've got that information. Uh -oh. Reckless. He's found Salivar. Stealth Bomber coming in. Salivar going to get caught out. The damage is just about enough. The flash finish from Reckless takes down the AD carry. It's a 50 second death timer. That is there if they need it. The uh, tidal wave is available if they need it. And they get an uncontested in here. Big, big plays. We saw Mr. Rales doing the same thing against Peke yesterday as well. That unlocked itself an inhibitor. This time around, two inhibitors picked up for Fnatic. Comes up the middle. They're going to try and tank this one out, get some of that damage down. And remember now, of course, with all that damage the Rocket have stacked up, Teleport comes in around the back. Dragons are sent on towards him. So has taken down the half hill. Points, we can see Sinai just at the top of your screen, taken low. That's the Guardian Angels. Going to get popped out. Rocket still very low coming from this one, though. Sinai does not get taken down. Fnatic escape with their lives. Jankos comes around the side. Can't get up. Peke quickly shielded out by Soaz. He survives. Aqua Prison lands as well. And Rocket, they have to run defensive duties. There's super minions on their Nexus turrets. It's taken so low. They're going to get it. That's going to be the Nexus turret going down. Fnatic, they're going to back away. But they just do the damage. That will go towards Fnatic. So, Baron picked so, so wants quickly it. going around. Vander does want it. He locks on towards Cyanide. He may be enough, but the wild growth, the wave comes through. Mega Inferno Bomb. Everything just multiplying in damage for Fnatic. Reckless comes in, gets the kill, flashes for it. Yankos goes down. There's the double for Reckless. This will be the game for Fnatic. They're going to punish Rocket in the base. Wasn't able to get it up. Fnatic have done it. Absolutely fantastic stuff. Fnatic go four for four right now in the league. It was far from Positive play. Distraught faces. Silent. At the bottom of the table, they put up a good performance this week. They held on lane face, worked very well for them, very well against Alliance, very well against Fnatic, but again, the problems persist, which is ironic because if you think back to the spring, they were strong in the early game.